Understanding a Retroverted Uterus and Pregnancy Hello everyone! In today's video, we'll be discussing a topic that many expecting mothers find themselves wondering about. Can a retroverted uterus affect a baby's ability to move during labor and delivery? What is a retroverted uterus? First, let's start by explaining what a retroverted uterus is. A retroverted uterus, also known as a tipped or tilted uterus, is one that tilts towards the back instead of the front. It's important to note that this is a common variation of the uterus position and is usually not associated with any health problems. About 1 in 5 women have a retroverted uterus. Does a retroverted uterus affect pregnancy? Now, let's move on to pregnancy. Generally, a retroverted uterus does not affect a woman's ability to become pregnant or carry a pregnancy to term. During the early stages of pregnancy, the uterus is small enough that its position doesn't significantly affect the developing fetus. As pregnancy progresses and the uterus grows, it typically moves into a more vertical position. Can a retroverted uterus affect labor and delivery? This brings us to the main question. Can a retroverted uterus affect a baby's ability to move during labor and delivery? Generally, the answer is no. A retroverted uterus typically does not affect the process of labor and delivery. As the pregnancy progresses, the uterus continues to expand and by the time labor begins, the position of the uterus is typically similar to that of a uterus that wasn't retroverted. There can, however, be exceptions in rare cases where the uterus does not correct its position. This is known as an incarcerated uterus, which may pose complications for labor and delivery. But remember, this condition is exceedingly rare. So, to sum up, a retroverted uterus generally does not impact a baby's ability to move during labor and delivery. It's important to remember that every pregnancy is unique and if you have any concerns related to your uterus or pregnancy, it's always a good idea to consult with your healthcare provider. We hope this video has been informative and helps to put some of your worries at rest. Thanks for watching.